connected. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Um, of course, you know I'm doing all my uh, mods. I'm not actually doing performance mods as far as engine and exhaust and stuff like that, so I'm not going to just blow the bike out of proportion with mods, but I do want to do mods that are quality mods, you know, like I did the skid plate, of course, because of, you know, to protect the engine from being busted in the frame and everything. And, uh, but one of the mods I wanted to do, and as you know, I had the Night Design foot pegs on my Africa Twin. Well, I also, they make the foot pegs for the Honda CRF 250L. And I loved them on the Africa Twin, so I know I'm going to love them on this. These foot pegs are extremely good foot pegs. Um, they are made out of 70, 75 billet machined aluminum. They are really good stuff. Um, you can see this here. This is called the Hunter uh, tread pattern on this one. And they also have one called the Tracker. The Tracker is actually what I had on the Africa Twin. These here have nice, real nice bite uh, for slick wet conditions. Your feet won't slip on them. And uh, you can also opt to, as you can see them bolts in here, these are made to where you can uh, replace these. Or you can change out and get the other style if you like the other style. So they just bolt right on to replace. These are also uh, 7 8 inch lower than the factory, so they'll drop it down a little bit. For a bigger guy like me, should be more comfortable. So uh, we're going to go ahead and get these things installed. One thing about this install is it's extremely easy. All you need is a pair of needle nose or pliers uh, just to install them. Simple as that. There goes my dash cam off on my bike. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get these things installed. And uh, the big platform on these, see how wide that platform is? Real nice and wide, wider than the stock. So that would be a real good platform for the feet to sit. Alright, so simple, real simple. What we got to do here is remove this pin. Just bend the tabs around until it's straight and pull it out. And you can reuse those pins. As long as you don't break one of them off, you can reuse them. Hold up on it a little bit and pull the peg out. The pin, I should say. Now we'll hold on to this clips because we want to put it there. Your, sorry, your spring. We want to put it back on the other one just like we took it off there. They go in the same location. And if you'll notice on here, if you can see that, there's actually a hole that this sticks into. So we need to scoot it up here in position, put in that hole, make sure it's locked down here. We'll slide our pin back in again, like that. Now get it lined up at the bottom, push through, we'll put the same washer back on. Might be easier to turn this thing to where it's in the down position. To get the pin started on here. Get it pulled through and bend both sides back. That's all there is to it right there. Man Emmer. That's nice. I'll put the other side on. Take these stock ones, put them back. You never know. Might uh, decide to sell the bike and get an Africa Twin or something.
that is all there is to it right there all right that's it that's the night design hunter tread uh, like I said you can get the trekker tread if you like them they have more like uh, kind of like pegs sticking up on them you can look at my uh, Africa twin video where I installed the trekker tread on it and uh, you can see what they look like they'll look just like this just a different way they fit onto the bike but uh, super cool pegs I'll put a link below to uh, Night Design so you can check out their pegs and uh, thank you all for watching Woodsman Adventures I'll do a review of these later please subscribe click the thumbs up on this video thank you all for watching catch you all in the next video right on